welcome back to deforestation the game come on give me a sapling because i want to i want to reforest in a different place i just i want this to be somewhere else where i have put it give me saplings what there is logs all the way up there jeez what a big tree and more Alright, whatever. One sapling. Good. Good enough. I guess let's uh, swim across here and see what's up. Actually, this is the tree that I've broken. Maybe this has some more saplings. Well, apples. Three saplings. Perfect. Because, you know, the last thing I want is to just completely deforest it. But at the same time, you know, I kind of... I kind of need one and I want to move a horn someplace else, you know? Yuck, yuck, no. Oh yeah, and then I should look into making the, um, the altar thing to spawn the librarian guy. Who, if I remember correctly, takes, like, paper for emeralds. Which is ridiculous. Once you have, like, a certain scale on the uh, sugarcane production. Because you can just... It's f like freer money than the clay deal. At least I remember that being the case, but I'm not exactly sure. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to all the sugar cane I can find out here and just replant it to increase like the the general area of production for I, I guess when I get around to that and decide to start scheming on the villagers. Perfect. Lots of trees that aren't massive and annoying. Like eight different separate log bunches in them that keep the leaves from despawning. Just just regular trees. Easy wood, easy seed, easy apple. Is that connected? Probably, meaning I have to go up against this monstrosity of a tree. How fantastic. What? Okay. That's just the saplings. I was like, what? Is that the guy with the trident from before? Not again. That was terrible, honestly. I, I Seriously, I don't know why the trident just, like, does so much damage. I feel like it's a bit excessive, but I guess what do I know, right? I don't know. I'm just, you know, a person playing the game, right? right let's take this down as well. And I think that'll probably, maybe... Just be a l just enough to get me the wood that I uh, so that, uh, enough wood to uh, get me the fences that I need to imprison. I mean, um, facilitate the wild animals that I have just uh, seized. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's, yeah. <laughs> hmm. So the thing I want to do is I'm going to want to, probably going to want to, like, expand it first and then break, like, the inner wall that it creates to let them out into the bigger area. But because there's uneven terrain there, I can use some of the dirt I got from my construction work to f kind of even out the area without it hopefully looking too terrible. And then we should be winning. But I guess, I guess we'll just have to see, won't we? Yeah, so I can just kind of close this gap between these two bumps here. That's fine. Okay, I'm, my accuracy when it comes to placing blocks is apparently non-existent which is why i just don't play m like uh any form of minecraft pvp because people seem to love building in those because it's just so fun when you just build instead of fighting ha 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 so that's what is that okay it was just a weird grass texture through a uh, or a dirt block texture through the grass. I was like, is that like something on the ground there? Or? 
so that should be the sheep taking Carol. Because they, I believe, need this space the most. Haha, <laughs> the most. Get it, get it, because there's cows on the farm. Laugh, laugh now, laugh. No, that's the gates. Actually, we could use maybe like at least two more gates. I mean, I can't think of a single situation in which there's no use for a gate ever. 45 fences, that ought to do the trick for at least the sheep. Hopefully. I think for right now, this is more than enough for the amount of sheep that we have. So I guess I'll just really quickly just... Uh, f I'll tell you what. We'll break this fence. Yeah. Come on, go through. Go through. Get it. Come on. Get in. Th no, 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 no. No. You, you come on. Go. We'll close that off. Oops. I know it's getting dark. It's time to go sleeping. But I will put the gate on this side. <laughs> Hold on. Trust me. This makes perfect sense. And then I will replace these gates with fences. And because chickens don't really need a lot of space, but they just could probably use a bit more, I'll just split, like, open it up like that. And I go, and then you two get busy, and I'll just get out here. The cows are a different story, but I think it's better to have it be daytime, because then I can actually, you know, see what I'm doing. Just pausing my own house construction. Don't worry about it. I have, like, no idea how to even continue the house construction, if I'm honest. I just... <laughs> I'm using the lack of certain resources as a... An excuse to just not worry about that right now. Need to eat the bread. You gotta enjoy this bread, because, man, I paid a lot of money for it. I mean, hell yeah. Right, come on. Let's see now. Alright, cows. Well, what I can immediately do is I can do this. Come on, get this grass out of the way, man. Bunch of nonsense. I don't really want to, like, have it be so that villagers can come and get stuck in the animal form. Like, I get that they basically have the same IQ as the cows, but I don't actually want them to be in the same location as the cows. You think? Yeah, what do you think? Is this big? I think that's probably big enough for them. They don't need too much space, do they? Shut up, cow. No, no escape. Never free. Hold on, can I? Excuse me. S Mr. Pig. Mr. Pig. I got you. I got you. Hey, -ya. you've been captured with no food. There we go. He he'll be the he'll be the guard dog for the for the herd. He'll just sit, sit in his own little little box in front of the farm animals and just stare at them menacingly, doing nothing, contributing very little. All right. So I had more deep slate somewhere, I think. Yes, yes. So I can at least probably get the towers built, if not fully, then I to an even, even point where they're all about the same height, which, you know, ain't too shabby. I can do myself, especially if it's a resource that is annoying to get as deep slate. Like, come on now. Why would I want that? How would I even go about getting that? <coughs> it just m appears in my pocket sometimes, man. I don't know. Yeah, wow. This really, like, it does take up a lot of it. <sighs> yep. I guess I'll try to even it out a little bit across the uh, board here. Maybe make it a little bit easier for me to kind of have a 
basic grasp of what's going on in the grand scheme of things if I'm like looking at it or where we're at construction war, you know I'm thinking the floor in these deep slate towers should probably be cobblestone or like stone brick because I feel like if I make the interior all deep slate as well in them it's gonna be like solitary confinement in them and uh, I don't know, man. I don't, I don't feel like setting up solitary confinement for myself in my own house. Ooh, the bamboo's ready. Well, it's not the bamboo, sugar cane, but you know. The green stuff that grows on the beaches, it's fine. Um, Alright, let me grab as much of it as I drop, because usually it spills half of it in the water. And then let's place more of it. And just increase the general production of it for when I actually will need it. This is the best solution for everyone. Ah, oh, well, there's a, like a very big amount of coastline here. Hello. I didn't know that was here. Hey, well, that means we have like lava nearby as well. I've got everything near here. This great place is great. Thank God I didn't stay in that stupid snow village. It would have been hell. All right, now I need to actually harvest heat. Because I have, like, animals to feed and stuff. Which is annoying, but whatever, I'm fine. I knew what I was signing up for when I got those darn animals. And also, we hit 200 subscribers, which is pretty pretty epic. I want to say thanks for that before I do go right now, because I it is, I believe it has been uh, t about 10 minutes, which means that we are just about running out of time. So thank you for helping, like you know, contributing to that. And uh, yeah, I mean you know, <laughs> first 200, and next. 300 come on i think we can do it what do you think can we do it before the end of october i don't know let's see but we will have to see at a later date in time because for right now i will be going so if you enjoyed the video leave a like subscribe if you want to see more hit the bell icon if you want to be notified of when there is more and uh, comment something wacky down below and i'll see you next time bye